Now, the perfect pastry, the most fabulous filling. What makes a top-notch pie? Well, today at the 11th British Pie Awards at Melton Mowbray, a newbie to the competition picked up the plum prize. Mm. Mel Coles had the tastiest job of the day. And the pie of pies is... John Thorne has curried sweet potato and butternut squash pie. Pie and ears. Until now, a vegan entry would have had a pie in the sky chance of being crowned a supreme champion. In fact, this is the first year there's even been a dedicated vegan category. We were only expecting 13, 15 entries. It's our second most popular class, 68 entries. In total, there were nearly 900 entries. So what makes a winning pie? It's a pie that when you walk into the shop, you want to take home with you. And, and that's what it's got to do. It, it almost jumps out at you. So, and some pies can deceive you and pretend they're that pie. But a winning pie will not only look amazing, but will then explode in your mouth. Winner John Thorner is clearly living the life of pie. I mean, I, yes, I, I never thought as a butcher we'd win a vegan prize for a vegan pie. I'm hugely proud, massively happy. It, you know, it's amazing, really. Sponsoring the first vegan class was a massive honour. And then for it to, to win, I couldn't write it, really, could you? <laughs> But it's brilliant because it's about time we broke the barriers. Well, a win of pismic proportions. The vegan movement has now taken the British pie world by storm and it seems this entry was a crust above the rest. Mel Coles, BBC East Midlands Today, Melton Mowbray in Leicestershire. It meant the world to them, didn't it? It did. Tears and everything. And more pie awesome. puns than you can shake a stick at. <laughs>